Hey YouTube, this is NJ4 out of 5 and I've got another one of those welders. Um, this one is, it's like a BRFC spot welder. This one is probably the one that has the most fits. This one I believe has 8 fits and it takes a little bit of soldering. Uh, to go with it, I also purchased a set of pins. These are the 16 square millimeter um, pins. I believe that's like, uh, I think 6 gauge or somewhere around there. Uh, I'm going to use 10 gauge wire with it. And uh, I got a little adapter so that I can connect it to this. So as long as this one works as intended, at the end of this video, we'll... Uh, as, or at the end of all five videos we'll give this one away too so this is probably going to be the second one of probably five so i guess we'll get into um taking it out of the package looking what we have and seeing what we can make out of it and then at the end of the video we'll do some testing
Okay, so as you guys seen by the test, I don't know where it's at, but if you guys can see by the test, I did two pretty good welds and both of them left nuggets out and uh, hard to pull off. So uh, when I pulled it off the nickel strip, that was 1.5. Um, it came with like some, I think it came with some one, some .10. I don't know, this one didn't come with none. Um, so as you've seen, it welded. Uh, I don't know how long it's going to last. Uh, I've seen a few uh, reviews online and they said that they used it and it worked like for a couple of tries and then it blew a FET. Um, they were also using version 1 and this is version 1.2. I don't know if this is the third board, the second board, the first board. I don't know exactly which board this one really is. But... Uh, as you've seen it welds the only thing that i added extra was i added the uh welding pin or the i will i added the uh spot welding pins and the 10 gauge um you can order these with their own you know soldering pins if you would like or you can get your own um again i'm going to give this one away uh it works so I don't know how long it's gonna work. So, you know, there's no guarantees. This is just a giveaway. And if uh, it works good for you, it works good for you. If not, you know, it's the luck of the draw. But uh, it seems to, it has 10 FETs. And looking up the specs on it, each FET is supposed to be able to handle 300 watts. So that's one, two, three, four. That's eight times three, which is what? Eight, 16, that's like, 2400 amps or something like that i doubt it could handle that um i only used it on the first setting just like i used the other one on the first setting um they did say that whenever this is on not to cross these a couple people said that whenever they had this and it was on they crossed these for some stupid reason and it ended up making it to where it was always on it didn't have no um their fets weren't engaging they were just always on so that's about it for this video um this one is one of the one of this is two of five uh the next ones are pretty simple and a lot more easier to build so if you guys have any questions please like subscribe and share and i will check you guys out in the next video